After 24 days of driving from Tanzania to reach Namibia, we took some time out to have a beach picnic. We then dug out the car and set off along the coast. In 1486, the Portuguese explorer Caio landed at this spot. This is a $200 bill. Oh, wait a minute, this is 200 Namibian dollars. No wonder, cool. And where's the queen? There's no queen on this money. There's animals and a cowboy. Cape Cross is one of the natural sea lion mating areas along the Namibian coast. Mom, oh wait, you're not my mom. How do they tell each other apart? one of the many shipwrecks along the coast, Ben decides to do some bartering, this time for rocks. <laughs> Near Swakopmon, Ben decides to drive in the world-famous Namibian sand dunes. While he plays like a little boy in the sand, I sit, drink cold Pepsi, and contemplate the landscape. He's stuck again. Uh-oh, that sounded like the fifth gear blowing out. Don't go into the desert with one car. Ben managed to get the car going, but we were now without a fifth gear. Ben is playing in the sand again, but this time without the car. He certainly is persistent. Why does he park on the train tracks? moved it just in time. That day we finally made it back to civilization.